Hello, this is Chris with usgalaxys3.com. Just a novice Android user making videos for you guys. Please feel free to leave comments, uh, make requests, or anything you want below. But please give these uh, videos a thumbs up and not a thumbs down. Helps me out a lot and uh, helps encourage me to make uh, more videos. What we have on the left is a Sprint Galaxy S3. Uh, it's restored to stock on the latest update. On the right, the white phone is a AT&T Galaxy S3 restored to stock on the latest uh, update. Both plugged into chargers. Both just added one Google account, not syncing with anything, just trying to get three benchmarks on here. Uh, Zag, regular Invisible Shield here, Invisible Shield HD right here. I have the brightness turned up all the way and the timeouts set real high with both of them. All right, let's go to the first benchmark. We're going to run each of these twice, and I'll call out uh, the results, and I'll also write them in the comments. We're going to go with Quadrant Advanced. I had actually launched that application on both of these. Uh, they're both coming off of a fresh reboot, so I don't know why that one prompted me and the other one didn't. I don't know if I mentioned this, but as you can both see, they're both in airplane mode. Not trying to get any notifications for anything while we're doing this test. This has a Belkin shear cover. This has a casemate. No, it has a spec candy shell case. You guys hear that humming? It's because we're uh, in my like 600 square foot apartment, and uh, with these lamps on, I pretty much have to keep a bunch of fans on. All right, so the result here was 4,765. Result here, 4,509. The full results of that test will be posted in the description, and now we'll run it once more. We'll fast forward to the results. All right, 4,523 here, 4,321 here. Now let's go to Linpack for Android. Go run multi-thread. 175.512 here, 170.027 here. Inconsistent results, so we're gonna run it until we get a consistent one. Okay. 183.134 time of 0.92 seconds and 190.369 and a time of 0.89 let's run it one more time 161.404 with a time of 1.05 seconds and 174.603 with a time of 0.97 seconds on the last one Nina Mark 2 Actually, uh, tilt the devices for this one. fifty nine point eight frames per second for the AT&T and fifty nine point nine frames per second for the Sprint version I'm gonna flip these real quick just so you guys can look at the clarity of the screens and see if the invisible shields have any difference between them
So 59.9 frames per second here, 58.6 frames per second here. So if you guys have any requests, like I said, leave them in the comments section. I'll try my best uh, to reply to you if you guys leave uh, comments. Uh, remember, most of my time is spent uh, with the Army, and that time that's not spent with the Army, I'm spending uh, on a couple forums and uh, doing these videos. So please support me by giving me a thumbs up on this video. Uh, subscribe to the channel, and thanks a lot for your time.